crazy, right? I think I'd be back. But, it's still live on my YouTube. Absolutely nothing to talk about, but I decided I really could. I want to make a YouTube video. So, this is, this is a map that I have no idea what it is, honestly. Um, it's like Urban? But I'm not sure this map name. Hopefully, I can see it somewhere. Core, it's core. I was right. Okay. But I really have nothing to pack up. One shot. Oh my god. I know. I know. I know. I just. I had three punches this week, which is great for school. I'm in college. If some of you don't know, if you guys are new to the channel. And I really don't, I need to start uploading more, but I don't know why, just because I've been really busy. And, like, just life kind of hit me, that's why I, like, the competitive stage. And I heard there's a lot going on with the competitive stage now, like, whether or not to ban, or not ban, but take out CTF, I think it would be a good idea to CTF is garbage. But, it's good on other games, it's not this one. Like, the spawns were kind of like kind of hard. The, the, the way they match up with the objectives and savings. But the spawns just don't work. They're not good. And like, if you kill someone, you expect them to spawn out the black like every other Call of Duty ever in like with <coughs> CTF in it. Sorry, I'm sure. But you expect them to spawn in a certain place, and they should spawn at their flag at all times. But in this game, the sledgehammer, I guess, that may be better and do something different, which is good for the average player, but not for the competitive player. So when you. When you, um. Say you push through the base and you kill everybody, right? So, you push through the base. Hold on, I gotta kill this dude. You push through the base, and then your whole team's there. Then the people should continuously spawn at the flag, not anywhere else. And in this in this game, they spawn them right next to basically, it seems like right next to your flag. So it's really hard to get pulls and counter pulls. Because, oh, it's easy to get counter pulls, but it's really hard to get pulls and captures to, like, go up on the captures. Because it, the other team's already in your base when you're running back to your base. Like, they beat you there, which is absolutely ridiculous. Because if you're sending cutoffs, it doesn't work. So, I I don't know if that's going to be taken out. I think it should, but I obviously have no say in the matter at all. Like, I'm far from it. Even some of the pro players who want it out don't even have a say in it, so it's just, just kind of bad luck for everybody. And I cannot find anything in this game. Are we winning? No, we're not. Shit. All right, so I gotta go ham right now. Right now, life is good. Um, I don't want to say that taking a break from Call of Duty was a good thing, but for me, it wow. was. <laughs> I made that kind of happen. But I, I just, it's a lot easier for me to go through school and not flunk out if I'm not constantly trying to get on and get better at the game. Which, as you can see, I haven't gotten any better. And knowing that there wasn't any progress with me anyway, I mean, I'm getting better at all. Like, look at that accuracy. Good lord. What a fucking losing A. But I haven't gotten any better, so I'm glad I'm actually doing okay as well now. And it's just 
it was an overall better decision for me, but I understand. It's a good man on the grid. Dang it. But for personal reasons, it was good. If you guys are curious on an update. I'm chasing this guy now. I'm actually doing okay this semester in school. Oh, that's a person. I'm actually doing okay this semester in school. Um, it's been fun. It's been really it's been fun. But I need to study more for my astronomy class, which is really cool. Like learning about the space and shit, and it makes me it actually every time I go to class, I feel like I'm an idiot. Just because of how small it is, it compares to everything else. Which is ridiculous. Like we we mean nothing in the grand scheme of things. At all. And that's the end of that game, so I think I'm gonna put that on. Go into another game, hopefully get like a 10 minute long one, maybe. I'll probably edit this one. Put that ahead on, put that ahead on. But, yeah, I'll talk more about astronomy in the next